Hey guys, what's up? <laughs> Thanks for tuning in. I pretty much just um, made this entire video and then went to press the stop button and realized it wasn't recording. So fun, how to practice. Okay, so let me tell you about my day. So I'm back at training, went to the first one in the morning. It was tough. And then the eight o'clock one, I went around the lake, ran around. That felt, you know, so good after. Um, but it was definitely difficult after taking some time off. And Shifu even saw it. He saw it in my face. He's like, okay, go take a break. So I went up to my room, had lunch, la, 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 la. After, at one, I get a message that maybe I should go back to Beijing tomorrow. But I was going to open up a Chinese bank account, which I need here if I'm going to stay so much longer because it's just everything in China is pretty much paperless. So, and I need to deposit money into my American bank account. So I need to get a Chinese bank account to do that. Okay? So I need to get it done regardless. I was going to take care of that this weekend. I'm like, I can't do that. So I might as well just go in today, right? I have time. I'll, I'll skip the afternoon training. I don't want to do that, but I need to take care of myself. So I'm like, I guess I have to do what I have to do. Terrible. Terrible. I get the taxi in, you know, which is too expensive. Then I go to two different banks. The first is Bank of China. They need an ITIN, which is a individual tax identification number or your TIN and I don't have that I'm not working here so the government hasn't given me one here and hold on and I'm not employed by anyone in the states right now so like I don't have a tax identification number I even looked it up I tried to figure it out before I left because Natalie had an issue and I thought you know maybe it wasn't going to be a problem but it was, and they're like, we can't help you at all. You need that. And I'm like, how do I get it? She had no idea, no idea at all. Um, so I went to the bank next door. She said, oh, maybe try there. They're less in like intense about letting foreigners have a bank account and students having bank accounts, which I think is crazy, but you know, this is communist China. It, it, it really is. So anything with opening a bank account, government stuff, financial stuff. It's pretty difficult to get done here. So I went to the bank next door and the lady, the teller wouldn't help me at, at all. She pretty much was just like, no, 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 no. And I was, she wasn't giving me a reason why. Um, so I was over her and I demanded to see, um, see a manager, which, you know, I basically did all on translate. And after about, you know, 30 minutes of back and forth, just no, no. Somebody came down and she was trying her best to help me, this woman, actually listening to me. Um, and I showed her, you know, that I was a student and I wish I had, it's such a mess here in China, uh, my original acceptance letter. But the uh, Mr. Gao who works here has collected all the paperwork from everybody and given it to our visa officer to for safekeeping, for safekeeping, for inconvenience. I'm going to be honest, for inconvenience sake. So she has it. And after, you know, maybe it's been like two hours at this place, the second bank, she's like, okay, if you can get this original letter, we can hook you up. We, you shows your proof of that you're a student, that you're studying. And I'm like, okay. So I'm back and forth, back and forth with the visa officer, calling, 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 not, no answer. I'm hounding her, being super annoying. And basically... The bank closes at five. I didn't know that. And nobody told me. And it's five now. And I get her on the phone and she can be here in a couple, you know, in like 10 minutes. I can meet her or whatever. I can come back. And the lady's like, well, we're closing. And there's just, I seriously, there's like zero communication. Everything is very inconvenient. They do it on purpose. I'm telling you, they do it on purpose. I'm not even joking. That's that's just a reality of living here. It's like something you have to accept. So <clears throat> I was like, okay, so what do I do now? And she's like, if you give me this letter, then we can set you up. Because what she really wanted was a school ID card, you know, that they get you at, they give you at a university. And I'm not at a university, so I don't have that. Um, so fine. I go get a taxi, meet my officer. 
I get the piece of paper and I send her a picture, the woman who worked at the bank over WeChat, I send her a picture and she's like, okay, uh, this should work, not sure, Let me, we should ask some people. And I'm like, who should we ask? I have asked everyone, I've done my best here. Um, I think it's your turn, just like, please, can you? And she's like, you know, a couple minutes later or whatever, I get a message, she's like, actually, that's not a real school official acceptance letter, so we can't help you. So because I'm not at a university, I'm not a student here in China, is that what you're telling me? So basically that's what she was saying. And I told my visa officer, that she's like, give me her WeChat. They started talking and she's like, okay, I have one other piece of paperwork or something that maybe we can give her and maybe we, this can work. But I have to go back in the morning and try all that craziness. And, but to top it all off, I get back to school, I'm exhausted that it didn't work out. It was, you know, I knew it was gonna be tough. I was hoping it wasn't going to be this difficult. And there's no hot water at the school. So I get in time for the shower and it's and it's cold outside too now at night and in the morning. So I just took a tub bath, you know, very renaissance of me in Maya's room. And we're just cackling about everything and venting so it was very good to bond with her and she's leaving soon which is very sad but yeah that was my whole day boring uh i hate this kind of stuff you know but you just gotta do it you gotta get it done i need this account i do i really do i can't i there's so many things that i need to i need it for it's stupid I will figure it out. Eventually, eventually, I will figure it out. It's going to take a couple more attempts, so I know it. All right, wish me luck for tomorrow. Thank you so much for tuning in. <sighs> this life, this journey, what is going on? I love you. Have a great day. Zai Jen.